back to town right now. Um... I feel like if I fi if I don't get resurrected, that counts as a game over. Reorganize the party. No, we're not going to come back. I'm just going to sell it. My keyboard is acting a little wonky right now. Okay, it's fine. Alrighty. Okay. Alright, let's see what I can do for spell crafting. Didn't level up as a teal, so let's go for that one. Ooh, new ones. Um,
I don't think I've sold giant guts to the shop yet, so I'm gonna go do that. First, I'm going to save my game. You're a tourist too? Guess you're not dressed like one. Whatever, just check this out. Or whatever, just check this out. It looks like a magic circle. The Imperial Sorcerer has created a magic circle here. Here's the catch that dumb fool Eugene who kidnapped the queen. Since they take you to the eighth floor, it's a bit too hectic for the average person. But the conference adventures will were full of seal. The message says there's a major reward for his capture. If you don't have confidence, why don't you go ahead? Oh, thank God, I've got a shortcut now. <laughs> ah. I was going to put one on the other side once you have um, unlocked, once you've made it to the next dungeon level. Or, or rather, say, once you've made it past the, the next labyrinth level. Since I used Kyo's transfer potion. But yeah, that's nice for them to do that, since, since otherwise the only way to get down to level 8 requires you to go through some poison hexes, which is a royal pain in the tuchus. Let's see if you have any. See if you need to buy any uh, giant heart or giant guts already. All right. Do you have the giant guts? No. No, you have giant tooth, but not giant guts.
Alright, so I'm just gonna actually head straight back to town, finish up with the, uh, um, spellcrafting. They're also doing one more run to level 8. Also, does give me a bit of advantage to save my game like one more time, so I don't have to go through the uh, uh, Magic Circle cutscene again. Of stone. It's a new uh, spell combination. Good to know. Almost mastered that one for Creo.
Super one. Before we go down, any new quest postings? I don't think so, but... There's a new one. All right, to go deliver an axe. An old dwarf shuffled his way towards you. It was Garcia. The one who hired you earlier to find Rui. I know a man named Wolf. That dumbass. He's out to fight the King of Darkness, the Vampire Lord. I can't believe him. You'd be surprised at his reason. Words of a woman. He was a cute knight named Grace. I Seems that her husband to be had an agreement with the King of Darkness. However, Grace was not happy with the agreement and wanted him to undo it. Garcia sighed deeply. The reason for challenging King of Darkness is a girl's words. Either admirable courage or just plain stupidity. He spoke ill of the man, but his face showed worry. Wolf is just too good natured. So when he sees a hungry kid or hears a girl's sad story, he'll just we will just start acting without even considering the consequences. Well, it's be because he got because he's like that that I got carried away and made this giant axe. You were handed a giant axe. It was about four and a half feet long, including the handle. It stood as tall as a grown man. Um, I mean, my character's a dwarf, so as tall as a grown dwarf, sure. Um. Oh. So, yeah. It's still pretty long, but not that long. Deliver that axe to Wolf. I'm on the verge of tears, swinging some lame weapon. Let's head toward the 8th floor, so as, so as long as he's not dead, he should be somewhere around there. I'm leaving it up to you. Okay, so, gotta go find Wolf and deliver an axe. I actually want to save one more time before I actually go run down there, so I don't have to accept the quest again. Okay. Let's go see a man about next. So, glancing at the map for this level of dungeon, looks like we have our first teleporter maze down here. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any f future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks. Also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.